welcome back to copy. Um, no, what am I talking about? Welcome back to PC builds with techno blocks with no copyright intended. That's what I was going to say. Not welcome back to copyright with techno blocks, no PC builds intended. That doesn't make sense whatsoever. But anyway, on with the video. I'm very excited about this build because it is the most expensive build I can possibly think of. This is the Do You Even Have a Budget build because it has two Intel Xeon E5 2699V3 2.3 GHz 18 core processors at £3,627, which is a lot. That's more money than I have in my bank account at the moment. So that is how much they are. Next we have the Intel Xeon E5 processor again. So this PC is going to have 36 processing cores, which is a lot. But then if you have the hyper threads, it will have 72 threads. So it's going to be a very powerful workstation and gaming PC. Then altogether that is over £7,000 already. Then we have two Corsair H100i GTX 104.7 CFM liquid CPU tallers at £110 each to provide tooling for our ridiculously expensive CPUs. Then we have the Asus Z10P D16WS SSI EEB dual CPU LGA 2011 3 motherboard which is 448 pounds almost so yep that is nice and expensive I mean this supports the two um, CPUs up here yeah what am I doing right there we go then we have 128 gigabytes of DDR4 memory which is 1440 pounds and two Samsung 850 Evo series. Wait, no, we've got a 250 gigabyte solid state drive, which will be like your OS drive, and then we've got another one terabyte SSD for all your games and stuff. And then just because we can, we have two, not one, but two GeForce GTX Titan Xs. 12 gigabyte super clocked video cards in two way SLI. And then for the case, we have the Cooler Master Cosmos 2, because it has a cool name, ATX full tower case, um, which is £300. And we have a Corsair AX 1500i, 1500 watts, 80 plus titanium. That is must be so um, efficient. Certified fully modular ATX power supply. Then we also have an optical drive, which is 763. And I've forgotten to put in an operating system. So this is how I do it. I just go onto here. And then I am going to, because I can have um, Windows 8 Pro 32 bit. Wait, why do they sell the 32 bit thing for that much? That's weird. Right, we'll have Windows 7 Professional then. Ah, here we go. Windows 7 Professional. Perfect. Yep. So, all in all, this build costs £11,777.74. And that's including the shipping. If I also go into setup with things like Adobe After Effects and all that really, really, really expensive animation software, it would be even more expensive. So I hope you enjoyed this PC part list thingy. I will put the link to the build in the description. So if any of you do have a spare £11,777 lying around somewhere, go ahead and build this PC. It will run any game, any piece of software. Because this is like the most powerful things you can get right now. So, 
thanks for watching this video. Remember to like, comment, and share this with your millionaire friends. If you have any, that is. Of course, I mean millionaires, not friends. Right. So, anyway. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe. And I will see you next time for more PC builds with techno blocks. With no copyright intended. See you later. Bye!